Okay, if you watch the first video where I explain how I organize all my personal documents in Evernote, you remember that my pin note was a note with all the documents. It was a giant list divided by people. That was good in a sense that I could find a number of a document just scrolling that list in, without leaving Evernote home. However, the list was getting too long. It was getting harder and harder to scroll and find the document I needed, the number I needed. So I decided to reorganize this using two Evernote features. One is of new is the notes preview and the other one is pretty old the connection with google drive so let me show you how i did it what i have here now is a more friendly list in my pin note it is is still a note but this note in reality now has links to other notes so i have another note that is my wife documents one note for me another note for my dog yeah his name is caffeine that's the word for caffeine in portuguese my car home and office i'm not sure if you remember but the home and the office notebooks they are spaces where i keep all the information I need for my home and my office. Okay, here's a good example. The other day I needed to change the printer cartridge. It's not something that I use that much. <laughs> I rarely print, so I never remember what the cartridge is. So all I had to do was click the office note and inside that note, I would find other notes that are measurements, uh, documents and office supplies. In my notebook, my wife's notebook and my dog's notebook, all I have is a list. It's the same list that used to be in the pin note, but now it's divided by people or places. So in my note, now what I have is a list of my documents and also the numbers, because remember the number is what we use most of the time usually all I have to do is copy and paste that number. So that's why I have the numbers. But the name of the document is a link and that's linked to the actual document, a copy of that document inside Google Drive. Why Google Drive, you may ask? Well, as I explained in other videos, I am an Android user and when I'm composing on email, on Gmail, it's much easier to tap the Google Drive icon and select a document or whatever file I need to attach to an email than to open Evernote and send that to the email. And I cannot do that with multiple documents. It's harder to do it from Evernote. So now I have the best of both worlds. If I need to see a document, all I have to do is go to Evernote, click there, and that will open the document in Google Drive. It will open here on my phone and it will open on my computer. It doesn't matter. And if I need to attach a document, it's just a matter of tapping the Google Drive icon. It's more steps now but it's more organized. It's easier to get to what I need because usually I know that I needed one of my documents or one of my wife's documents. So it's easier, I just tap my name there and I have all the documents. So I know that in that note, everything is related to me. The same goes for my dog and the office and home. So in a way, although it's more steps in a way, it's faster. That's it. Thanks for watching. See you soon.